This is Andrew Huberman. Habits are a big part of who we are. What we do habitually makes up much of what we do entirely. And for this week's challenge, I will be trying Andrew Huberman's morning routine. To start off Andrew's morning routine, I have to wake up at 6 a.m. And apparently, he does this without a alarm clock, which is crazy. But anyways, the next step is to get hydrated with some water with a bit of lemon and salt. Apparently, this helps with hunger, which is good because we are going to be fasting until 1 p.m. Also, it's good to stay hydrated. I can't lie, the taste wasn't very enjoyable. It was a bit of a struggle to chug down, but I finished it. Now, the next activity on the list is to do some yoga. But this isn't just regular yoga, this is... Yoga Nidra or Yogic Sleep in modern usage is a state of consciousness between waking and sleeping, typically induced by a guided meditation. Not gonna lie, it's nice to take a moment and just be present. But that's not what's happening here. I fell asleep. It was a nice nap. I would definitely try it again. Yoga is finished. Now it's time to put on a sweater and go outside for some vitamin D. Well, that was the plan, but it turns out that it's cloudy today. As you can see, there is no sun. So we won't be getting any sunshine. Absolutely no sun. But it was still a very nice walk. I enjoyed it very much. I hate to say it, but sadly, walking is over. After that peaceful walk, Andrew Huberman continues his morning with a ice cold shower. I was really enjoying this morning routine, but this cold shower has ruined it. But cold showers do have many benefits. Here is a list of the benefits that cold showers have. Let's do a quick shower flex montage. Cold shower completed. Now let's get ready for gym. But before we leave, I have to help my lovely mom take the clothes to the car. Now we can leave. We made it to gym. It's time to do a leg workout. Workout completed. Now we have to do something very important, a flex montage. Okay, we can leave now. For the next step of the morning routine, we are going to get some coffee. But we can't just get any coffee, it has to be Andrew's Huberman favorite coffee. So let's go to Smart and Final. Damn, it turns out Smart and Finals doesn't have it. But they do have a lot of delicious desserts. I'm really hungry, help. Okay, since Smart and Finals didn't have it, let's go to Target. Once again, they had everything else but the coffee that I needed. So I left and got on the bus to go to another Target. This one's way bigger. They should have it. At first, I didn't see the special coffee. But then I finally found it. They even had different flavors. But I decided to get the Tropical Uprising. Also, they had a lot of Christmas chocolates. Look at this massive Kit Kat. It's bigger than my head. 
All right, all right, let's walk home. Oh, look, the sun is out. I'm finally getting the 15 minutes of sunlight. Finally, we get to have some calories. This is gonna help with the hunger. Damn. I'm going to be honest, I'm disappointed. This drink is garbage. It tastes like watered down juice. Sorry, Andrew, but this drink gets a 3 out of 10. Garbage. Anyways, the next activity is to do some productive work. So I'm gonna finish my essay. Now, you have to answer this one question. When does productivity in a person peak? Is it option A at 5 p.m.? Option B at 2 p.m. Option C at 8 p.m. Or option D, 11 a.m. The answer is D, 11 a.m. According to media, productivity peaks around 11 a.m. and tanks after 3 p.m. So, I guess try to get your work done before 3 p.m. Oh, guess what? I finished my long essay. Very good, my friend. Finally, it's time for food. At 1 p.m., Andrew Huberman breaks his fast. It's time for Senor Chef to go to work. Oh yeah, some liver. Those are the ingredients. Breakfast is ready. For today's breakfast, we have liver with potato, cabbage, syrup, mustard with a bit of sugar. Leave a comment down below if you want the recipe. My personal rating for this dish is incredible. You know what time it is. Breakfast is finished and it was delicious. I give it 9 out of 10. Nice. Guess what? We completed Andrew's Huberman's morning routine. Besides having to take a cold shower, I really enjoyed it. I got my workout out of the way early in the morning and was able to finish my 8 page essay. Morning routine rating 9 out of 10. Alright. How's the boat going? It's bulking season. See you next week.